As we go through life, one of the big questions about things we purchase is, is what the value of it is. Alright. Battle rap and motherfucking video games. Grand Theft Auto 5. Where we at? What this look like? Y'all don't know what this is, you losers. This is Dubai. Dubai, 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 Dubai. That's amazing, right? Look at this shit right here. I got Hollow the Don winning against Rum Nitty, and here's why. Um, Hollow is a certified vet. We know that. But one thing about Hollow the Don is he kind of is like Lux. He's done every level, every level of battle rapping. He's not a slouch. He's not one of those you could just say, oh, yeah, he's going to clearly lose or some shit. For one, he can freestyle. Two, yo, this man, y'all forgot he was on 106 in Park as well. He he won all his shit. Undefeated type shit. You know what I mean? You know, a little slight stuff like that. So, I don't know why people act like... Damn, that shit is nice. But I don't know why people act like ring rust with him... Is a really big thing. Battled Danny Myers not too long, well, a couple years ago, but it wasn't long ago where it was like, oh man, it was bad. No, when he battled Danny Myers, he was fine. This man, you know, Hollow has been on movies. He done battled people in the streets randomly. I mean, on the spot battles, battling fans, all kind of shit, bro. He does music, whether we think it's good or not. His ability to rap should not still be questioned. And I don't think that's questioned. I think it's the fact that Rum Nitty, Rum Nitty is so incredibly active. And he just won a $100,000 competition hosted by URL Caffeine and Drake. Man gave $50,000 to them on the spot. So I understand that. But, that don't mean anything to vets. And we've seen this a million bajillion times where that doesn't mean anything. Those stacked up accolades before you battle the vets don't break the fact that those vets are who they are. And they've been doing this at this high level for this long. It's not like... They did it for 10 years, but they never, like, did, they never did rhyme schemes and shit before. You know what I mean? People act like these concepts of battling today is brand new. They're not. And the fact that they just tweaked versions of what's already been done is the reason why vets say what they say. And the reason why people feel the way they feel about vets. Because... Damn, that shit crazy. He's about to kill me in seconds. Motherfucker, I'm Superman, bitch. What's wrong with you? What's wrong with this nigga, bruh? Thought we was cool. Let me go to this shit. This nigga crazy. Oh, this ain't shit. That's a lighthouse. I'm stupid. Damn, where'd he go? Damn, I punched his ass all the way over here. But anyway, yeah. Rum Nitty, yes. He don't have any ring rush. He's current and everything, but... Like, uh, what I'm trying to say is, like, 
Bro, Hollow is so multi layered with his ability that it's not really it's not really gonna matter with just bars. We've seen that happen even with Surf. It did like people are still debating if he won or not because of his star status. If that was anybody else, we would have been like, yo, he just lost. That's just what it is. He just lost. We wouldn't be debating if he won with a choke and everything. If Rum Nitty was clean, how'd he get over here? Oh, fuck. Cheating bitch. You know what? Fuck that. I'm gonna let you fight your damn, your arch nemesis, bitch. Fuck off. But yeah, he's multi-talented in the way that he raps, the way that he approaches bars, the way that he approaches his angles. Everything is unorthodox with him. Like, the way we credit Rum Nitty's bars, I think I think the way we credit Rum Nitty's bars is the way that Hollow the Don is as a battler in the whole. Fight him, motherfucker. Why are you over here? Oh, shit. Damn. That shit crazy. You want to do that shit, motherfucker? Finally, they're fighting. Yes. This is what they've been wanting. What the fuck? Kick his ass. This is like daylight versus lux. Not this way, but you know, the history and legacy. One from the west, one from the east. coming over here to me. Go fight him, dummy. Why? Alright, enough. Guess I have to do this myself. This is like a job for copyright. Fuck off, pussy. I'ma kill the shit out of you. He killed me. In slow motion. Ain't this some shit, man? Ain't this some shit? But, Hollow, I mean, Rum is gonna need more than just his ability to rap. Like, Hollow is really going to have to be sloppy and lame for him to lose from just bars. Because I don't think he loses to people with just bars. Like, he just does too much, man. He be having a whole room. You seen what he did with Clips? He had the whole room guessing bars. A lot of battlers, you can't say did that. You can't say a lot of people have 
broke down a person's entire style and then had multiple people battling that same person with those same angles. Like, he is the king at introducing brand new unorthodox angles to people and then everybody else uses it and act like it's some fresh shit. He did it with Lux. He did it with Tay Rock. Like, he do this shit. He did it with Surf. And, oh, man. All right, I'm about to get Magneto on my team. Let's see what's up, man. So, Rum is just going to have to do more than rap. That's what I'm saying. Like, if you can make an argument for Rum Nitty, because he's got to the level he's at with his skill of rapping alone. But you're going to need more than that when you're battling, especially when we're talking about a stage. Stage came back. It's a little different. A lot of people are not going to survive that stage. When it come back now, Rum Nitty has been on the stage before, so we're not going to act like, he hasn't been on the stage. But what I'm saying is, you just, you just need more. And it's okay to need a little more. He's going to have to bring that audience to his side. Like, if he's doing, if he's expecting to win with just bars, if you're expecting to win with just bars against Hollow, then you need to get the audience on the side of wanting to hear bars. You got to deflate the performance. You got to deflate everything that Hollow is known to be able to do. Because if not, there's, you know, them rebuttals might be crazy, man. That alone. And I, I just hope, all right, when I mean by trying something new, I don't want them to literally try something new to the point where it looked terrible. Because you know how some people try to throw in extra stuff and extra sauce because they battle in a certain person and then it, it like fucks them all the way up the momentum. They they might stumble, choke, all that shit. And I don't want that. We're going to kill Godzilla today, damn it. In New York. Motherfucker. Yeah, I got more than one map. Look, Dubai in the distance. Nice. Uh. Alright, King Kong. You my ally. Wait, hold on. Let me go over here. All right. Amazing, right? No, ally. I Dude, relax. Did you get your fucking weeds? Anyway. But yeah, so far I got hollow winning. That's all I'm saying. I'm going to end that part of this conversation here. I just wanted to talk some battle rap shit while I'm playing the game. That's all. It's not really a, a prediction or none of that. I guess you could call it that. Damn, this shit crazy. There we go. Fight! Yes! <laughs> yeah, let's go! They fighting, nigga! Damn! He smacked the shit out of you. Oh, 
oh, fucking us up. You hit us with that flare. How the fuck this nigga get on a building? Oh, shit. Wait a minute. Look at that shit in the distance, bruh. That's fire. Superman is out of here. What is he talking about? Fuck. Y'all niggas, bro. I need to heal. Damn, you can see them niggas in the distance. Alright, let's turn the lights down a little bit. I'm healing faster at night. Throat is like some kind of teleporting. Oh my god, this dude is unstoppable. Alright, that brings us to a close. I got Hollow 2-1.